should be interesting to see how many cops we see today. <laughs> I made a post on my Facebook yesterday about uh, about how useless the cops are. I talked to a uh, NYPD cop here in Queens uh, two days ago. I was working here in Queens, back here again. Uh, and, uh, you know, they were spraying the fuck out of us. I mean, it was fucking horrible. And, I mean, I'd been working out in the shit all day. And uh, I go up to the cop and I, I, I point out the chemtrails. And I hand him some literature, some information about what the chemtrails really are, which is fucking mind control. And, uh, and he, you know, he was kind of reluctant to take it. He says, I say, have you ever heard of chemtrails? He says, and he kind of hesitated for a minute, and then he says, oh yeah, I've heard of chemtrails. <laughs> kind of weird. And, uh, and so I said, so I hand him that information, and, uh, and I says, well, you know, you guys really need to start doing something about this. And he just kind of looked at me and says, well, what can we do? I says, well, you can do a hell of a lot more than I can. That's for damn sure. <laughs> I didn't say that part, but uh, I did tell him, you could do a hell of a lot more than we can. And uh, he just kind of gave me a weird look and, uh, you know, kind of took the information. And I think they're all coached not to take information from people. They're, you know, they're not allowed to really really comprehend the fucking crimes going on in our country. They want to stay stupid, dumb fucks and stay the tools of the fucking uh, New World Order criminal government. And so they got to keep them stupid and, uh, and criminalized. Here comes some more. They got to keep them stupid and dumbed down and, and propagandized to their their fucking New World Order Nazi shit instead of what's really happening here on the streets and what's really happening in our skies and you know there used to be a, a on every cop car used to say serve and protect now it says serve and protect the New World Order <laughs> fuck the people Fuck the people that are being poisoned for, by fucking psychopaths from hell who want to take over the world and form their new world order government and terrorize the fuck out of people with mind control, directed energy weapons, and planting us with nano chemtrail shit for all kinds of shit. Look at all this. This is going to be one of those kind of days, I got a feeling. <laughs> Yeah, you, po you post stuff like that you, uh, onto your Facebook, watch out. <laughs> Next day, here it comes. Here we go. Oh, he had a big old American flag on the front of his little Nazi mobile. He's got a big old mind control piece of shit on the front of his truck there. <laughs> they got him all fucking mind control. Everything you see in New York's got a fucking flag plastered on it. Buses, trains, anything that has to do with the government. That fucking uh, Nazi flags flying around. Yeah, there's the trash truck. And this is your government, folks. Mind control land. But I, I was reading another uh, uh, good uh, good post by that somebody sent me, or uh, I just happened to to read on Facebook, and uh, uh, it talked about uh, how uh, what part of their this agenda, this spraying, this spraying is submitting many facets to this chemtrail shit. I mean, it's like. Once they, they got approval to start doing this psycho shit in our skies, destroying our fucking environment with their geoengineering or, or uh, 
their pretext of glo fighting global warming. And what, it, what it's actually turning out to be is one of the reasons they're spraying so much all over the world is not only to fucking implant us with mind control, which is their, I think, their, their number one main goal, but it's to purposely heat the environment, warm the environment, so that they can melt these polar ice regions, these northern northern regions that are covered by with all of these resources that they want to get their greedy little filthy hands on, the New World Order, the Committee of 300, the, the bankers from hell, the Freemasons from hell, I mean, the Illuminati, all these fucking criminals are after you. It's all about greed. It's all about money. And so what they're doing is they're heating up, purposely heating up the world so that all, all these areas start to melt. And they can go in there and fucking drill for oil, drill for gas, uh, mine for their gold, or whatever the fuck that they're after, these fuckers. And they got their harp shit now that's, that can beam deep into the Earth's crust and find all this stuff. And uh, so, they're not, so they have to figure out a way how to, how to, uh, how to get it out. So they're going to fucking poison us all like fucking rats so that they can get their filthy, greedy hands on more, more money and more resor resources for them. I mean, this is, this, is, this, is the, this is a big agenda. This is part of it. I mean, to destroy our fucking world and our environment to get their fucking greedy hands on more, more money, and more resources, destroy more of the environment, destroy and kill more animals and plant life and wilderness and environment that these animals rely on to live and we rely on to live it's just it just never ends with these fuckers and, and what and when they're what they're doing is they're creating this global catastrophe that will unite the world and bring about their new world order that's why you see Al Gore pushing this fucking global warming shit. It's it's all about oh we have this horrible global catastrophe that's bearing down on the world, and if we don't all come together to deal with it, we're going to uh, lose our world. So you know we've all we've all got to to come together and and fight this global catastrophe that they're fucking creating. So it's just uh, we got fucking psychopaths. I mean, they're just fucking insane. And it'll open up shipping lanes up there in, in Canada and Russia and in these areas and uh, they can they can go after their get their grubby little greedy hands on more more resources to to destroy our environment and line their fucking pockets it's a committee of 300 this is uh, Rothschilds and Rockefellers and fucking bankers from hell. They don't care how many people they destroy. They don't care what kind of world they create for people. How much they poison people and plant people. I mean, all this shit. And if you hear shit about the Russians and the Americans going to war, I mean, to me, it's just a crock of shit. They're all in this fucking shit together. It's one big fucking world fuck coming down on us. So they can all work together to get their greedy little filthy hands on all this shit. It's their plan for their new world order. Fuck the people. Fuck the environment. Fuck the world. They own it. <laughs> like George Carlin says, you ain't part of the club. Well, I don't want to be part of that filthy ass satanic club, that's for sure. They could give a fuck about anything decent, holy, and good. 
All they care about is money. It's the bottom line. Follow the money. Follow the rubles. <laughs> they're trying. They're going to open up that whole fucking northern world. It doesn't matter how much they have to poison everything and destroy everything. They're going to do it and mind control us in the process and plan us with sh shit from hell. <laughs>